What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's Dan here. I want to welcome you guys back to NBA 2K20, my career. Moving on now. We have a game against the Knicks. Uh, let's look at our progression real quick for an endorsement. I'm wondering where the next one's coming in. Really, really close. Got to get to that 1 million uh, fans to get the Nike Signature Athlete stat point. Uh, if we go to active contracts, uh, let's see what we're sitting at here. 2K, 2K cover athlete. We're already there. Nike, we're elite. We're going to get to his signature in a second. And beats, elite beats. And then we hit Elite Gatorade. So, signature must be the highest. Unless it's not. I don't know how you would put it. But uh, we're pretty much all the way with these guys. So, that's good. We're 23rd overall in jerseys. Really? Okay. Even though I'm number one. I doubt that. But, anyway. Let's go back into the neighborhood. Get our training done. And see if we can get another win. Thanks for joining us here on 2K. All right, guys. Let's get it. Knicks are not playing and too let's great. Out of breakdown. Looking at some stats for him. And if you measure a player that's pretty crazy tip off coming up no well, stats we know <laughs> a little intimidation factor da thanks so a look at our starters for the Knicks Barrett and Randall are in the forward positions then it's Robinson then there's Alfred Payton and it's Dotson in at the two go. and for what will make the fans we need the two stars George and Leonard fill up the forward slots then it's Williams then it's Montrez Harrell, and it's Quinn in at the point guard position. Oh, get that filth out of here. By Another block by Harrell. Outside Williams. Good ball here by Why? Harrell. Easy. Good on the well, that's about recognizing a transition opportunity when it presents itself. Nice job by Kawhi Leonard. Well, around this time of year, lots of national broadcasted games, Doris. Does that impact the players, you think, in any way? I certainly think the guys are aware of the nights they're on national television. Some guys... Oh, Lou! Yeah, there's, you know, the opportunity nice! The I love those touchdown passes. The, the regular season, those nights where you know the entire country is watching, that's a big deal. Stripped it! Here's Quinn. Oh! That's nice filthy. Jam. He's gonna put that one in his scrapbook. Insane dunk. And now they're starting to rub it in. Build up a lead, and here we go. Oh, Maybe what happened there? I got a foul? Time. Yeah, quick foul to pick up right away here. Weird. In the first quarter. That didn't even look like it. I got a little antsy there. Here is Robinson. 14 points from him the last game against the Suns in Phoenix. And don't forget about the two blocks. He really changed the game for his team on the defensive side. Here's Quinn. Ooh. Here's Williams. Lou. It's rebounded by New York. Well, we didn't see the same kind of control we're used to seeing from him. This guy is usually a tremendous finisher. Ooh, get rid of that. Barrett kicks to Peyton. With the teardrop, and it's good on the way in. I'll tell you, pull out the floater when necessary. Alfred Peyton pretty. Here's Quinn. Ooh, nice big reverse. Beauty. And how about that? What a sensational finish. Yeah, you you got to be able to get some hang time to do that one. Peyton drives in. Ooh. Nice block. Loads it up for Williams. Oh, I don't want Lou. Up and oh, and he gets it anyway. Two for three from the field. Floats it up for and Williams. Lou Williams. Matt, I mean, I've seen Lou dunk, though. I've seen him dunk. Working the ball inside and so I know he's got it in him, just not the lobs, maybe. Now, here's Barrett, defended by George. Here's Peyton and the reach. What a block. No doubt he's struggling right now from the field. Let's yep. see if he can get it going. Why? Wow. Incredible wingspan, unbelievable hands. The alley oop is easy. Knicks trail by 10. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. Handle down low. All I can Let do is stand, stand there. Handle with the bucket. And the combination of his quickness and soft touch around the rim really allows him to pull off shots like that. Ooh, reach in. Don't have the reverse I was going for it, too. Dude, I, I didn't even call for it. He just passed it. Bad pass, bro. That's annoying. Here's Peyton. At least he makes up for it. Uh, a defensive stalwart 
so far. That's six blocks. Popping it, Lou. Protecting the rim. No dice. The hustle. And right from the start, Kevin, they've been pounding the glass. Most of those 50-50 balls also going their way. Look at that Walking defense. And the Clippers will go the other way with it. Gotta keep rolling here following the win against Memphis. I thought they had a solid Why? Game all day. Coming into that one. And Get the assist kind of dealt with, you know? Along the way. I thought their game plan was really spot on, Greg. And we saw that in their scoring more than anything else. Oh man, how did he even get that to? And he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. Gets one to fall, but only a second make in the first seven attempts. That's no good. And so George will bring it up for the Clippers. First chance of the season for them to go up against this. Oh, pass. Team. Yeah, and they swept this matchup. I got rid of it in time. I just shoot fast. Held the advantage on paper and on the court. Well, a year ago, there was a big gap in talent between the two teams. But changes are always made, and we'll see how they match up this time around. Indeed, that time from Leonard. It's all about the defense right there. Without that level of activity, he probably scores it. Williams dishes to Quinn. Whoa, jump ball. There, but no one has possession. We'll have a jump ball. All right, I've won one of these before. And it's the Clippers. Oh, the I thought I had it. I but did have it. Knicks, they come into this one following along Strip. the Phoenix. Plenty of space. Yep. And off the glass. That one's good. I try to make a lot more jumpers. And the story here, Kevin, early on is how well they've shot the basketball. Passes to Dodson. Floats one. It's nice. rebounded by Leonard. Leonard's got his fourth rebound with Pop it, Lou. Here tonight. Nice. Boy, you think back to the Rodgers. Loving them making these shots. Railed almost all of the 2018 season for Kawhi Leonard. I'll tell you, he is back to peak form and reminding us that he is elite on both the offensive and defensive ends. The oh, we get a little put back though. No dice. Time from here. And he did everything he could to make that shot as difficult as possible. If I waited a little bit, a little bit more, he would have slammed that bad boy. That's okay, I'll take it. The ability to anchor your defense. And you talk about the best two-way player in the NBA. I think a lot of people, Doris, would put Kawhi Leonard at the top of that list. Looking happy about that. He's really psyched. He's like, yes, time out. We can, we can have some Gatorade. Five points a game for a season. He doesn't necessarily wow you with his eye-popping athleticism, but the reality is this. All right, I got some time to relax. Oh, no, I don't. I thought I did for a second. Champion. Big group substitution here for the Clippers. Zubac is checked in for Montrez here. Jermichael Green comes in for Kawhi I did leave Leonard. him, but he was like. Was checked in for George. And it's Patrick Beverly in for Oh, did I get the foul? Oh, it's an ant. What? I should have stayed down then. Bobby Portis. All right, now they're pulling me. I got two fouls already, so. And we're a little over a minute and a half. Oh, whoa. Of what was that? And George gets the whistle that time. That's his first foul. And the Clippers making a change here. Harrell's checked in. Pass to Knox. New York moving the ball around. Robinson up top. He's gotten some minutes. Oh, I'm nowhere near. He passed off, though. Here's Dotson. He's That's totally money. That's assist from Peyton. Well, what you want to see from Alfred Payton are floor general skills on full display. Finds the open Too much speed. Setting the four for the Knicks. It's Randall and Robinson at the four and the five. Then there's Payton. I love the give. That's a give and go action. Two. Knicks trail by 15. Kicks it to Payton. Bricks that one. by the Clippers. Harold's got his fourth rebound with that last one here. Tonight. Money. They have been bored yes. dominant in this game. Lou is very clutch. You gotta love him. You can always it's Mr. Reliable that right there. In between range, they've been the much better team. Peyton passes to Robinson. 
And we're now a little over two and a half minutes into the second quarter. Hudson can't hit. You know what, though? Sometimes you can be too open. I think it may have surprised him, and that's why he missed. Here's Quinn. To get open. Come on, Robinson. man. That's annoying. Quinn, no good. And that's where you want to make the bad shot pass. selection. This guy is a good scorer, but the defense was right on him. All right, let's catch up. I with tried to get in the way. Reporter David Aldridge. Kevin, before he became a head coach in Memphis and New York, David Fisdale spent eight seasons as an assistant under Eric Spolstra in Miami. Now, Damn. said he's a brilliant basketball mind that has exceptional gold standard level communication skills. One of the most talented coaches I've been around. So, Kevin, Fisdale is highly respected. David, he sure is. Great reputation. Now getting his shot. Thank you so much. Randall, good, and the assist goes to Robinson. Well, that, that's one way he can finish, but far from the only way he gets it done. He's got all kinds of tricks up his sleeve. Here's Quinn. Oh, how did I even finish through traffic like that? He's seven for that's nine. wild. This guy has been a catalyst for them all game long. What a job leading them to this lead. Dotson kicks to Peyton. Looking to end his cold spell. Rebound by Harold. Harold's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Quinn is Run it. George. Ooh, that PG, is what is that? Randall is some nice that weak team. sauce. Here's Dotson. Oh, what a block. He it again. Oh, he lost it, though. Shots away with ferocity. And GA, he is not messing around in this one. Oh, For don't three. sag on Noxie. New York. Wow, they bricked it. Plus eight in the rebound differential. One more reason why they're in control. Well, hard to find a team more Too buttery. in the NBA. Plenty of space. Pull up, Jay. Knicks. They are a premier brand. Greg, this is absolutely true. This is an organization that has played a few games in London that have helped them, and it hasn't seemed to matter that. Oh, he's all alone. He can make those. Period of time, they remain a major media presence in a major market. The NBA is better when the New York Knicks are. A Got it. Oh, what a pass! Oh, I didn't mean to take over. With the circus move. Mm, so smooth. I didn't even cover that lob, so I had to adjust. They've been struggling here on Oh, backcourt. Yeah, I think I would have got that sure. steal anyway. And now you see the 2K leaderboard. Not only have these teams caused a lot of turnovers over the last 10 games, but they've scored off them as well. The Clippers, number one. Because of my steals, I mean, they've right? They've gotten a little more aggressive defensively. You can become a more confident team on that end. And it's so much of it, I think, has to do with forcing turnovers and creating offense. Why? Marcus Morris has checked in for the Knicks. Whoa, what and was that weak stuff, Kawhi? Come Knicks on, trail bud. By 21. Here's Dotson. Oh, I'm stuck in this Looking animation. Numbers, he averages a bit over nine points a game. Oh, what a block. Why? Why? comes over to help shoot it here's Quinn Connecting managed to get it wow Quinn's got that was silliness though yeah they're going to have a nice I'm cooking in that I don't know New York's gone one of four from three-point range in the second not a whole lot dropping out there for them time call here the Knicks decide uh, to trying to get rid of my takeover I didn't mean to activate it coaches in our meetings Doris talk about their players staying on a string helping they help, help defend it's annoying that I'm only catching board. like layups. No doubt. And there are certain guys Maybe that silver will help. Paul George to me was a defensive player of the year category. Uh, Rudy Gobert, multi-time winner of the defensive player of the year. Rudy is considered a great shot blocker and no question that's the case. But it's because his defensive rotation is so good. Guys like Marcus Smart, the ones willing to give up their body, fly around the floor. Look at that D. That's a horrible and shot. Aren't they fun to watch? So fun. All right, a chance to check out stats for Paul George. Some nice work from him over the last 10 games. Averaging 12 points, 6 rebounds, and 2 assists. And he brings it for them every game on the offensive end. Oh, oh man, I'm getting really fed up with these empty looks. Role, being the catalyst on the offensive end, night in and night out. 
Here's Dotson. Outside Robinson. Six to shoot. Here's Peyton. I'm there. New York, no good that time either. I'll tell you, it feels all night like this guy's been forcing shots, rushing shots. He's what? Really struggling on the Dude, what is with this game? These are wide open. And here's Peyton. He'll bring it up for New York. I have the gold badge. It's so annoying. That's in the best to Morris. Here is Robinson, defended by George. Falls back and trains the fadeaway jumper. What a joke. Robinson's got four points this quarter. Here's Quinn. My Robinson shots are not going. I don't know how smart that was. Trail by 21. I mean, I've, I've, tw tw we are up 21, so we can afford to do this. Here's Dotson. A little bit. He kicks it to Morris. They double him with George. Stripped away. Got a steal. Leonard, the pass to George. There you go. And George with this stuff. Boy, that open look set up by Kawhi Leonard. That's probably the most underrated aspect of his game. Not Stripped it. Loose, all by himself. All alone. Oh, wow. And I think that play sort of sums up what we've seen. I was trying to change up my dunk because I always do reverses. Both sides of the ball. Smart basketball defensively turning into easy points. The pass to Morris. We've got 148 left in the second quarter. Shot clock at six. He's gonna have to chuck it up. He's guarded by Williams. They get the rebound. Oh man. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. Way to attack there and then create the contact. I gotta hope he misses Linux this. Have made three free throws so far. Haven't missed any. There you go. And, and Jinxed it. On the season as a unit from the free throw line. Catching up on the chain. I gotta start slamming it on him, man. Posterize them. From Andres Hill. Green comes in for Leonard. Marcus is checked in for George. And it's Patrick Beverly in for Williams. The Clippers shooting their third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. And team free throw numbers really about as good as you could ask for. Around 80% on the season. The That's pretty good for here. a team. Portis is checked in. Here's Smith. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. You know, Doris, when you think of the best dunkers at that guard position, you have to include Dennis Smith Jr. His explosiveness, Dennis Smith Jr., is off the charts. Boy, when he is attacking the cup, as a defensive player, you better be on point or he's going to put it on your head. To the middle. Arky. There you go. Down. Two points with his first shot this game. There you go, buddy. And Good I've job. Been impressed with the unselfishness, but also getting guys the ball where they can do something with it. And he has shown a terrific feel da, for da. how the defense is playing him, and then taking advantage of that. Got Stripped it. it. Get the ball, though. Oh, that's so annoying. Keeps possession of them. A chance here to rank. That wasn't a steal. The NBA, the race for the rookie of the year. How about these guys? Oh, what a group! You look at Barrett. While not in the top five currently, he's definitely on the so right screen, bro. and he's been playing some very solid basketball. Just pick up the ball, and it's been quite a rookie season for this group. Uh, amazing how well they've adapted to the professional game. Boy, it really is. There have been very few growing pains for this group, and it's no small sample size we've seen. They've been at it for months. These are bona fide NBA players now. As to Green, Clippers moving the ball around. Feeds it to Gwynn over Smith. What was that? I wanted a post fade. New York's gone one of six from three point land in the second quarter. Less than 20%. Oh, look at that, D. Continue to let him fly. Well, that's a case where a guy's trying to make a play, trying to take it up strong, but the defense was ready. And one. I already know. And he's got a free throw coming up as well. I'm sorry. That's poor defense down low again. It's been a mismatch thus far in the paint. This is his third free throw attempt of the game. And you know, guys, he had a big game at the free throw line in their last outing. Oh, I thought he was fast, so. Pulls up, high post, and too long on the shot. Beverly, the pass to Quinn. Oh, that worked out nicely. Don't allow the defense to set up. Just in time. A beautiful fast break opportunity, and the finish pretty good. Ooh, he almost made that. First half, a pretty lopsided affair. The Clippers on top. Delivering the blow up. 
All right, Dave, thank you. And time now for the halftime break with the third quarter soon to follow right here on 2K Sports. Damn, it's up high. Look at that. We'll find out if this game becomes the route that it's threatening to be. Let's go, boys and girls. Exceptional performance from Quinn. And the way that he has helped out with the ball movement has been a difference maker. Passing it. There's 10. I was waiting on those 10 uh, points or 10 assists. But boy, all night he's been willing to make the extra pass. Under down low with four with Harrell in the middle. Then it's Paul George. Don't sag, don't leave. it's Williams. And it's Quinn in a point guard. That's the five to begin the second half for Doc Rivers. Heat. Look at that defense, son. Go that time. Great D that time from Leonard. The Clippers shooting 59% up to this point. They're working for great shots and they're hitting all day. And the That's too easy. As he slams it right over Randall. Getting it done. They just left him on an island, so obviously I'm gonna chuck it to him. You get a double me, that's what happens. Stripped it, grabbed it. They're ignoring the scoreboard and playing hard. Yep. That's number five on the steel front. Makes dunks look easy. That ball looks like a grapefruit in his hands. Now here's Peyton. He's covered by Quinn. I'm Spaz Robinson. Here's Randall. Look at that D. Oh, he got a box out. And Robinson with the layup. Robinson's got seven. They're getting points. destroyed though. Really nice job to convert the push. He's guarding him deep. No one's in the paint. He stayed with that play from start to finish. That's yep. something we say about him a lot. And and really keeping the ball hopping around here offensively. The Knicks have gone one of three since starting the second half. Guys, they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had weird a tough animation. Time taking the lid off. We know Alfred Payton can affect games with his defense. You want to see him make those kinds of passes right there. That's nice. Outside Leonard passes it to Williams. Here's Quinn. Payton on the double team, and we're going to have a jump oh, man. right up there. And the Knicks with possession here. Oh, my bad. And so Peyton will bring it up for the New York Knicks. Outside Robinson. Pass to Randall. A D. It's hauled in by the Clippers. George has got six rebounds in the game. Here's Quinn. Oh, that looks money. working now with the new shot clock. Williams can't get it to go. The Knicks have gone two of five, shooting here in the third quarter. Peyton attacking. Ah. On the follow. It's been their Achilles heel defensively. They just have not been able to control that backboard. Quinn kicks to Williams. Leonard on the wing to the paint. Here's Quinn, and it's blocked. Get the ball. And the ball travels out of bounds. See, I wanted to spin off of him. Here's Quinn, covered by Peyton. It's deflected. Oh my God! There's no foul in there. I cannot believe there's nothing. Now here's Barrett. Seems like a wasted Tight possession. On him. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. It's on Kawhi Leonard. As you and I were just talking about this, as more and more players are going public with their trade request, do you think that's had a negative impact on the game? Well, Kevin, I certainly think it makes long-term planning for NBA franchises a lot more difficult. Oh! Contractually, we are not seeing them hold true to the particular organization they may have signed that contract with. The reality is this in today's NBA. You've got to be nimble as an organization, and you have got to be attractive to them. And I mean that with great ownership, great leadership. And who are the players currently in your system? You have got to be incredibly nimble to be successful. In God damn, NBA. we can't get it. I think you're right on. Okay, well, let's check so in annoying, with man. Now, what can he do? Sideline. Jumping like a rabbit. Well, we all know that circumstances and time changes everything. In Dallas, Dennis Smith Jr. thought he was going to be the cornerstone. But with the arrival of Luka Doncic, everything changed. 
the promising point guard was traded to the Knicks. And Smith said it was important. It's a big opportunity, and I've just got to make the most of it. Well, Kevin, we know one thing in New York. The ball is back in Smith's hands. There's another one. Keep it going, baby. Thank you. And he has just been in a flow offensively. Terrific game. He has been the X Factor. Here's Peyton. And Nowhere near him. We're trading hard. points here. Well, if you allow Alfred Peyton that close to the rim, his athleticism will finish it for him. Here's Quinn. Ah. Uh, three points for him. I should have I should have lobbed Knox. it. Hammers Get it over the pass. Go it over the arms. The uh, and just willing to take chances defensively pays off in a transition basket. That is quick defense to offense. These guys are such terrific Ooh. athletes. You can't let your guard down. Oh, reversed at home. Loving that these. Ready. Agreed. The Trying to catch up on those points. Display. Peyton looking around. Here's Randall. That's a bad shot. Oh, he makes it. Wow. I'll tell you, tough Randall's been playing well tonight. In the rear view, the shooting percentage starting to reflect that. The Clippers have gone 8 of 12 from the field since the beginning of the third. Here's Quinn, guarded by Robinson. Oh, Robinson my God. I'm playing like an idiot. Maurice checked in for George. It's only my second Knicks, turnover, but it just Marcus seems Morris like I'm. In for Robinson. I tried to go around Dennis the big man. For Alfred Payton. The Knicks shouldn't just 34% from the floor. Inside. There at the pass to Smith. Oh. He's shooting free throws. Number four in five years. The free throw drops for Smith. I'm off. All right. Okay. Wonder if I'll be back on in this quarter. Probably not. Nope. Here's Quinn. And he uses Makes it. Glass on the way. Quinn's got 10 points here in the second half. And with the lead, I like the strategy here. Continue to get the ball to guys who can do something with it. One thing we've learned in the NBA, the game is never over. So you've Ooh. got to continue to score, continue to build your lead. And New York, looking at who they've got. The speed. There, the forward. Oh, Smith is out there with Alfred Payton. A lot of dunks Robinson tonight. In at the center, filling out the middle. And, and guys, that was just goading him. As easy as he made it look, you've got to have some skills to pull that off. Well, he's got plenty of those, yes. that's for sure. Payton finds Smith to the inside. Randall. Oh. He gets that one. And he has starting to turn it on now after that slow start. Of course, it seems like Adam Silver, the NBA commissioner, is one of the most well-liked commissioners in all of sports worldwide. All day. I think that's so. Well, I think he was amongst the most important members of the staff of his predecessor, David Stern, who obviously oversaw the greatest growth in NBA history. The NBA became a global game. But Adam Silver didn't skip a beat. He is a great listener, a great communicator. And I've said this about the NBA for a very long time. It is a league that is in constant self-evaluation process. It is always looking for ways Ooh. to improve the league, whether that means organizationally or with the play between the lines. And that's all you can ask for, Kevin. Quinn kicks to Harkless. Dishes it to Quinn. Third minute of action now gone here in the fourth. Magruder passes to Quinn. There you go. Just make sure the shot's good. Quinn's got 41. And they are attacking the rim and getting great results. Here's Trier. Strip and them. Steal for him. And that's his sixth steal of the night. Imposing his Damn. At the defensive end. I'm scared to sell Boop it. The field. He can do pretty much whatever he wants. Big time play right there, showing the activity and ability to impact this game. Oh, I thought he overed him back, but he didn't quite cross with the ball. So. Ellington kicks to Bullock. Down low. It's what a blocked. block. Just a solid performance on the interior. The rebounding. Oh, God, that was beautiful. <laughs> Cap that one off with a little something extra switching hands on the dunk. He knows how to get some hang time there. Great play. Ellington, the pass to Randall. Stay down. I don't want to lose my uh, takeover. That's good from Ellington. 
great finish. What a setup. Terrific ball movement there. Oh, Damn, there it is. No it down. Really catching up on these points. Beautiful move, Kevin. Mm -hmm. Why go straight up when you can throw down the reverse? Well, that one's going to have its share of time. Strip him. Real for sure. Get it, get it. Oh, he gets it back. Teams, if they can keep the rights to their best player, we see in another Damn, league. that's too bad. I thought that was mine. Ten ever make its way, do you think, to the NBA? Well, this is going to be a negotiation point between the Players Association and the league itself. And the reality is it's going to have to be negotiated. What we know unequivocally, Kevin, is that these players now in the player empowerment era have more control about what franchise they play for and how long the duration of their contract is. How this all shakes out remains to be seen, but it is a point of conversation amongst the Ooh. 30 NBA teams. And the oh, that's point eight of a no shot, bro. Taj Gibson's checked in for Kevin Knox. Who's up off the inbound? Oh. Oops, there's the 24 second shot clock violation. I tried, so man. Turn it over. That's a bitch. New York's gotten off four three pointers in the final quarter, and two of them have fallen. The pass to Gibson. Kicks it to Ellington. Randall surveying the D. Five on the clock. New York needs to get off a shot. Get oh! And that'll be two free throws. That's five. I should have stayed down. With the foul. I'm going to be out before I even get my 50 or my... Look how close I am to my 50 and 14. 50 and 15, sorry. Taj is a guy who has always approached the game from a veteran standpoint. He's a great leader, great defensive player. Oh, foul, though. And in between the lines and out, you can count on Taj Gibson. And now, in his second year of coaching the Knicks, David Fisdale putting more no MVP chance on this team. I guess we're not in that Changing final minute. Mindset of the franchise. Well, the New York Knicks hired David Fisdale to steer the ship. All right, no more reaching. Of young players. And I want you to think back to where he earned his stripes. That was with the LeBron James and Dwayne Wade championship Miami teams. So he knows culture and he Oh, knows he made that winning. one. Freer, that's good. Well, the big man, Taj Gibson, pretty assist there, Kevin. Here's Quinn. It's over Ellington. Wow. That's filthy. Gibson 51. Making it look easy. I think we should get dead eye. They've gotten into a dead eye silver. Going six of ten here in the final quarter. Here's Trier. You know, Doris, you and I love history. And we were talking the other day, you and I, about Bill Russell and his 11 championship rings. Do you think anyone's ever going to break that record? I think it'll be close to impossible, Kevin. And the reason is, number one, uh, there were so many fewer teams back then for Bill Russell. In no way diminished. There it is. The I just wanted to get it. I saw it was teams, wide open. Both there you go. Between the lines and outside the lines, Bill Russell will always be an historic figure. Uh, but it's very tough to compare eras. There's now 30 teams, nutrition, conditioning, coaching. Uh, there's just so much more information in the current era. Back to Ellington. Let's it go from deep and again. Oh, he made it with the triple. I thought he was on the line. They've been terrific from beyond here in the second. Inside, here's Harkless. Harky, it's come on, bud. New York. Unbelievable. He blew that. Look, guys, no clue what went wrong there. I'll say I'd That's release normally. The fade away. No good from Gibson. Well, that's a blown defensive coverage, but it doesn't matter. He cannot answer the bell. Ooh. Basket good. And he's starting Catching the lease, baby. Killer instinct this quarter, looking to extend the lead. On the wing, Ellington, guarded by Quinn. Passes to Bullock. Pass to Gibson. Now here's Ellington. Oh, I left He's him. What was I thinking? The shot by Ellington, no good. 
they are enjoying the commanding lead. And it really gives them the opportunity oh. to give their start. Gotta love that momentum. It's always critical when you get ready for that home stretch. Yeah, you know, he's flat fueling their success. Most of the offense has gone through him. Trier passes to Gibson. And ah. tagged down the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Doris, we've both been very public in our admiration for LeBron, the face of the league, for so many years. When he retires, and we're, we're approaching that date, who do you think might step up and, and take his place as the face of the NBA? Well, probably the most likely candidate is the new and reigning MVP, and that's Giannis Antetokounmpo, who is an absolute physical force. He's put on 50 pounds. He's getting more and more skilled. When he adds that three-point shot as a consistent that's weapon my board. to an in-between game, he will be impossible to guard. Kawhi Leonard, you know, he is now sort of Easy buckets. over as a multi-time winner of the finals MVP and certainly a player guys want to play with. So just a couple of possibilities there, Kev. And, and as we head to the final buzzer here, a crushing blowout. Big time dominance, and, and this will go in the record books as a gouty win for the Clippers. And then oh, oh damn oh, he is a highlight reel unto himself, guys. Uh, that could be loving these slams, the bro. Of the year, I think. Coach and coach letting me stay out. Now here's Ellington. Defense is right there. One item that stood out, their ball movement. Things are definitely clicking. And more oh, man, what was that? I was actually trying to pull really up. Hard to defend. Here's Trier. Oh, I say I'm like, oh, my man. And here's Bullock, doubled by Quinn. You now, gotta do something Bullock. with it. Just his first attempt. No oh, come on, let me get my board, bro. We've got 28 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Here's Quinn. Oh my God, my shots are not dropping. Knicks on offense. Near the three-point line, it's Bullock. And the Knicks miss again. All right, I got the last you shot. Can't look at the result of that shot. They'll take that whenever they get it. And they should, because it's when you start turning. There you go. That <sighs> little buttery finish to get over 60. Start to bog down a bit. Convincing lead with very little time remaining. And the fans are pumped. Well, they're getting ready to Damn. celebrate, no doubt, GM. Another they solid win. There's to lose at this point. So the Clippers winning this one easily. They won this game going away. They were the better basketball team by far tonight. Heads and down, bro. In this sort of dominance, particularly here at home. It's a great feeling when you play almost a perfect game. And that was close, man. A lot of fouls tonight. Like, look at how easy it is to get that. I'm about to get my final. Even with all those shots I took, the shooting is just, it's so much easier for me to get inside. That's why I wish I had more inside badges, but I guess I don't need as many. But, I mean, just that, that's more what I play as, so. 2K is weird when they make their choice of who's getting what, you know? So, we got to go for fans right now, guys. The 2K Sports Post Game Show. Hey, welcome back to the studio. Hey, man, Kenny here. I thought you did a great job. Oh, I didn't and mean to skip. Do it for the My bad. Why'd I skip that? Now I can't get easy fans. Wow. Home team power ranking. What's that again, Hank? Yeah, I'm glad you asked. In this segment, we rank performances from our hometown heroes over the past week. Now, who played the best, who played the worst? And I'd like to start at the very top with Che, someone who, in my opinion, was far and away the best. Anything else we need to know about? Sometimes there's nothing. Not even particularly close, Hank. Oh, a little bit of something, something. Oh, a little Gatorade wrap. Che, Che. Hey, what up? All right. I have a huge opportunity for my favorite client. Why does this guy have a big smile on his face? Uh, you see that? I do see it, and I feel it, and I'm with it, and I'm excited too. I have something really fun planned for you. It's to help promote Gatorade. Yes. Okay. Yeah? Do you trust me? Uh, long answer, yeah. Short answer, no. <laughs> <laughs> I heard a yes in there somewhere. Come Did on, you put him up to this? No, what Levi is dead set on this being a surprise, I want to tell you like a normal person. Where is your sense of drama? It has to be a surprise. See? Okay, fine. Oh, that's my man. Surprise Boy, it is. Where are we going? All I'll say is strap it. in. Let's go. Strap in? Yep. Bro, are we like skydiving or something? What's going on here? Dude, is that actually what they're doing? 13,000 feet above ground. This We're skydiving. Hi. 
hate you, man. What? I said I hate you. Oh, no, yeah, that's just a fear talk. No, it's not. I seriously hate you. Reese, is this safe? The vault's a fine safe. That's not really reassuring. Uh, okay, yeah, it's safe, 100%. You just tell me that so I can jump. Yes, jump. You can pull out at any time, all right? Just remember that. You don't have to do this. I don't know about this, guys. No, no, if you want, we got this stunt double right here, and he's ready to go. He's ready to jump. Why does he look just like me? That's showbiz, honey. We got to protect the stars. Life's pretty cool, right? Yeah. Do you want to jump or not? Because we got to go. I'll do it. All right, all right. I'll do it. I'll do it. I have to do it. Yes. So what I do, just jump and hold the Gatorade bottle? Yep. Yeah, and jump with the bottle. Okay, cool, I can do that, let's do it. Don't Just forget, remember. mug to the camera yeah, on the way down, right. smile. smile to the camera. All right, show smile. Just keep looking at the camera. Show yeah. my teeth. Yeah, yeah, right you got it. Okay. Left, it's the yeah. All right, yeah. Ready? Okay, let's do it, yeah. Okay, here we go, one, two, three. Get some some more woadies. Oh my god, you gotta show the drop, bro. I can't believe they did that. That's awesome, dude. And we're just shy of getting, well, we're still just shy, but getting the next one. That was an awesome little event. Man, that stuff is so cool. Literally, as soon as he said strap, they said strap in. I'm like, um, skydiving. And that's exactly what happened. That's too funny. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, do me a favor, hit that like button. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. If you haven't yet, be sure to like and follow my pages on social media. Facebook.com slash DanQ8000. Twitter, DanQ8000. Instagram, DanQ8000. And Snapchat, DanQ8000. If you want to get yourself a shirt or hoodie, link in the description. If you want to save 10% on your next DX racer, link in the description. Sure to use the promo code DanQ8000 at checkout. All right, guys. Thank you so much again. Take it easy. Have a wonderful day. I'll be seeing you soon for more content. But until then, let's hand things over to Knox Hill. Have a good one, guys. So I'm back, yeah, give me that bow. You lane like a trap train, give me that ah. Hell nah, they ain't running like this. I'm a marathon bitch, man, the air is lying like a rock. We ain't moving. You know me, been chilling at the top. This the type of feel you only feel it when you hide. NBA 2K on the dot. Drop it.